How do you feel about the recent drop in Bitcoin prices? Do you think fear is gripping the market or is it relatively composed? Let's explore the current situation. According to one on-chain analyst, the Bitcoin market is not yet in a state of panic. They argue that the Bitcoin daily realized profit loss ratio is an indicator of market sentiment and that there needs to be an uptick in the number of addresses in red, warning of impending panic selling before fear and panic fully grip with the market. Uh, however, the analyst also notes that the absence of panic selling bars suggests that investors are still processing the current events, even as prices crater below $56,500, the market is not yet in a bear breakout formation. The sell-off force prices from the March to May 2024 range, but it is unclear if there will be more losses. The analysts expect more losses with sellers in the driving seat and Bitcoin within a bear breakout formation. The immediate support is at $50,000 and $45,000, marking January 2024 highs. Another analyst thinks that this could be the best time to scoop more BTC at a discount. They note several fundamental factors that paint a long-term bullish picture, including the availability of spot Bitcoin exchange traded funds, ETFs, regulatory clarity in the United States ahead of the highly contested presidential election and the upcoming $16 billion payout by FTX trustees. Um, however, before there is stability and this week's sell-off countered, there must be an uptick in new addresses. Once this is observed, it would mean that new investors are pouring in creating demand for the coin. For now, prices are plunging and fewer addresses are being created. So is it time to buy Bitcoin at a discount or should investors hold on tight and wait for the market to stabilize? Only time will tell. And uh, with that said, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.